Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure and this is Farming Simulator 2022. You join me here, embarking on a brand new career in the Farming Simulator 2022. I'm playing under the, uh, the nom de guerre Barry Turnips. This is my tractor and this is my story. There you go, as you can see, Barrett, he likes to sport his, uh, his full riding uh, on uh, get-up. Ensemble, I think I was going for there. He's got his riding helmet on, he's got his pea coat, uh, pair of jodhpurs, and some boots. And, of course, some safety-first gloves that leave no print. Um, so, yeah, I, uh, I've taken on a, a quick-fire kind of a gig just to get started here. And, uh, and that is do a bit of the old fertilising. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah I'm, I'm well into that. Uh, right, yeah, bang that on, although arguably I've done this in the wrong order. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, oh, I have. Yeah. Only if I need the front weight. Do you think we need the front weight? Wait, wait, no, mate. No. No, we don't We don't need the front mate at all. Um, right, so I need to figure out where the heck I'm going. Uh, should be flashing up to number two. Right, bit of fertilising. I am, however, going to need a bit of fertiliser in order to make that happen. Which means I'm going to need to go to the old map here and find out where one might procure some fertilizer. Um, that's cow feed animal dealer. Right. Train. Yes. Important. Train. Yeah. Uh, Stag lager. Ah, if I, need some, if I need some beer, I know where to go. Uh, something, something with a chemical symbol, a biohazard, anything along those lines. Sawmill. No. Train. No. GLW could be anything. Uh, more GLW, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good to good to the chocolatier. Uh, good stuff there. Um, yeah. I don't, which map am I on? Oh, I'm glad, glad you asked because I can remember. Certainly, I can. Uh, I'm at the at the uh, Erg Ergenblatt or Ergengrat or Blatt. It's one of them. That's that's where I am. That's a spinnery. Yeah, yeah. It's a supermarket. Well. I took her to a supermarket, I don't know why, but I had to start it somewhere. So I started, never mind. I mean, it's, it's one thing to know the lyrics, son, it's another one to quote them back to people. Let's zoom out just a smidge. Uh, supermarkets. Is that the, uh, what's this, the uh, the huge and Tobler? Yeah, 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 let's go to the huge and Tobler. Excuse yourself, mate. Don't want to mow you down with my tractor on the first, uh, on the first outing. No, that looks like a spanner. I think the huge and Tobler there is for doing. Oh well, I, we, I mean we could, we could uh, soylent green him. Well, I guess that'd be soylent brown. I suspect. What about the uh, Varan and Arm Harm? Uh, well, I again, I don't. I think it'll have the word supermarket written on the front. You reckon? I mean, uh, we're in we're in some kind of country. We are. Uh, do you want to look at the map again, just to be on the safe side? Yeah, yeah, yeah I think. It's it's probably advisable. Spinnery, yeah. I can't even remember which one of these it was. Glue, could be, could be anything. T why don't you do this? Uh, growth, no, no. Soil composition, yeah, nice. Hot spots. I want productions, workers, contracts, workers, others. Others? Others. I don't think that's, that's just showed me. That showed where all my stuff is. I'm, I'm helpful, I, I suppose, but uh, no, what, what I'm looking for here is I want to, where can I buy, I'm not going to the flaming manual, you can forget that, son, uh, the, the lime station, does lime count? No, it doesn't. Sawmill? No. Supermarket, right. Back her up to the roundabout and then hang her that way. 10-4. Okay, yeah, good. All right, yeah, I will do. Back, back her up, you say. Is there, surely there's an easier way. Excuse me, mate. Oh, it's not your morning, is it, sir? Uh, no, you you appear to have been, you know, malfeasanced by a tractor on multiple occasions already. Hey, Hope. Well, that, you may ask yourself, and I don't blame you, uh, why is it that you are starting out by working other people's gigs? Uh, you may also be wondering why I'm swerving all over the road, but that's neither here nor there. Uh, he's gone the wrong way around that roundabout. Um, uh, uh, well, the answer is, I always like to start off as an oldie. This will do. All right. Have they got a? Have they got a? Have they got a? I don't know. Pop out and have a look. All right. Let's see if there's uh, an interface option here. Hello? No. I guess not. Uh, maybe there's one round the back. Maybe I get to use the tradesman's entrance. 
I am a tradesman, after all. No, 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 this is, no, that's a sell it stuff. Oh, for cr I, it's going to be perilously difficult to actually fertilise this field. Were one not able to get fertiliser? Um, Alright, no, I'll find it. Do you want to try the glue? No, I don't. I want to find something that looks like a shop. A shop. A shop. Hmm. There's the lime station again. I Yeah, I know. I like lime as much as the next man, but I'll be honest, I don't think chocolate's going to do it. Or gas. Or spinning. I think it's going to be glue. Okay, all right. Well, let's go to glue and uh, and see what that's all about. Uh, mercifully, this is a drive through supermarket, so we will drive through it, or at least around it, and, uh, and go from there. Anyway, to get back onto the main thrust of the narrative that we were trying to push forward, uh, you may be asking, and indeed you may be, why is it there, Colonel, uh, that you've opted to? Oh, flaming uh, That you've uh, you've opted to work for someone else rather than start your own establishment and build your own empire, as it were. And I go, well, yeah, that's, that's a good question. Shop. That's a garage, though. I don't reckon they're going to sell me a 500 kilo bag of flipping nitrogen infused death maggots. Uh, I think also you've gone the wrong way. Because somehow you manage to actually flag on the uh, on the map where it is you want to go. Uh, that's, that's true. Uh, well, we'll try we'll try the garage if uh, if none of this works. But I mean, let's let's face it, it it'll oh, for crying out that this tractor's not very keen on you know snapping back into alignment. No, no, it's not my driving. Right, do you want to pull in here? No, I think it'd be safer if I just go on foot. Uh, right, okay. Shopping basket, look. Great. I'd like to glue a plate. No, those are vehicles. It's not what I... I'm, no, I'm not ready to be browsing that kind of behaviour. Not yet. Grain, grapes. Yeah, 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 yeah. I need some... some. I need fertiliser. Uh, oh, discounts. Discounts. Yeah, good. Like a discount. No. No. Um, this stuff. Big bags. Sounds good. Give me a, uh, a pallet, palleted big bag of solid fertilizer. Thank you. Yeah, I'll take. Don't wrap it. I'll ride it home. Yes, I do. No, I'm. I'm. I'm deadly serious. I'm well into it. Yeah, no, it's, that better be the stuff. Where where it goes? Over there. All right. Okay. So now, um, I think you'll find. Shut up. That uh, you're where you started. Yeah, yeah, I think I, I think we will find that, uh, but it's okay. I mean, uh, you know, we we got to see a little bit of the town, and uh, and that's you know that's solidly good. Right, you've got somehow get your trailer next door to that and uh, and fill her up. That'll be okay. There you go. Just just nudge it a little bit. That's good. Have I got you got some instructions for me? Doesn't it usually say refill or similar? I have known it to say refill or similar. Yeah, turn on, no, no. Ah, wait. Refill. Ah, get in there, son. Yep. Go on, fill it right up. And then we'll... That's not really filled it by much at all. Do you think that's going to be enough? Well, this caper only pays me four grand, so uh, it better be. I've, I think you're uh, I think you're going to be sorely, sorely disappointed at the pay you're getting from this. Um, but anyway, let's let's go to the field and, uh, and we'll, we'll make it happen. Uh, in case you're wondering, yes, I have got crop destruction turned on. I'm not entirely convinced that it works on other people's crops, but if it does, then that would be super because over time we'll be able to see the uh, the path of destruction that I have I have created, that I've carved for myself. Anyway, to return briefly, if I may, to the uh, original thrust of the conversation that we were having here before I was so rudely interrupted by me. Um, why am I taking a job for someone else to start with? I think it's it's nice to have a warm up, you know, you know, just to get your eye in, get a feel for the place. Uh, I mean, look, mountains. Ooh, yeah, look, big mountain over there. Look, yeah, I bet loads of people die on that every year trying to prove their masculinity to themselves. It's always blokes. Um, yeah, they'll go up there. Go, do you want a sherpa? No, mate, I'm trying to cut down. <laughs> I'm going up in my flip-flops. Uh, and then uh, and then they're never heard of again. And you've got to go, well, all right, that's uh, 
That's on you, I suppose. But uh, well done. You get a little bit of media coverage, but you're dead anyway. Um, I, th I thought I'd just bring the mood up a little. Uh, right, which one is two? Let's not do the wrong field. It's this one. Is it this one? It's this one. Okay, right. Let's run over just a few of the sunflowers. And uh, then line her up there. Line her up. Good. About here? Uh, a bit further. You're not even close to being lined up either. No, I'm not. But uh, the sentiment's there. How about that? Yeah, whatever. Uh, right. Uh, uh, deploy? No. Do we need to deploy this? No, just, just fire it up and get ripping. Fire it up and get ripping. Right. Uh, start rolling. Fire it up. Get ripping. Okay, we're rolling. Good. I'm hoping for some kind of progress bar on this field. I'll be honest. Otherwise, I've just chucked two grand at arguably no benefit. Are we hitting the... Yeah, well, no. You're hitting the footpath quite nicely. Good. Good. It's more of a bridal path than it is a footpath. Well, okay, it mouse to about the same thing, but, uh, you know, whatever whatever tickles your fancy. How are we supposed to know which bits we've done? Is this at least colouring it in? Not so as you'd notice. All right. In which case, I'll just pull a Yui at the far end, and uh, and we'll see how we see how we go. I've used uh, I've used a uh, hundred liters of me uh, of me chemical masterpiece here already. Uh, I may even and this goes against the grain. I may even turn it off when we get to the bottom. I want to conserve as much as of the uh, the precious nutrients as possible. There you go. That's you lot done. Right, hang a Yui. Oy, lovely. No, 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 your alignment's completely skew with there, Squire. Yeah, all right, hang on. Let me, uh, let me, let me pull it around here. Yeah, and then uh, pull it around here. Yeah, okay, yeah, and then about here. Well, you're going to be overlaying the other lot again, but yeah, sure. Sure, do the grass while you're at it. The grass will appreciate it. That's fine. No, this is, this, this feels good to me. Oh, I hope it does, because uh, you're going to be, you're going to be out of fertilizer in no time flat. That's okay. We'll be we'll be all right. It's gonna be it's gonna be fine. Yeah. I mean, you haven't exactly left tire tracks for yourself to uh, to follow. Now, this is something that will change when we reach my own property. Yeah. Yeah. Once we once we've stopped working for ingrates who don't pay enough, then uh, then then we'll be good. I might even have a quick look at the contract when we reach the far end, just to see if any of this is registering at all, or if I'm just basically papering this with money, which is not what I had in mind. I mean, if I'd used one pence pieces, then maybe we'd get somewhere. Uh, and, well, I mean, you'd have plenty of them, at least. But uh, using this, this rather expensive uh, bit of ICI's finest is not really going to work for me. Just go straight round like that. Straighten it back up again. Yeah, you reckon? Yeah. I thought you were going to check and see how well you were being scored. I might do it in a minute. Hang on. There you go. Right. There. Let's have a quick look. Because uh, that's important. Yeah, it saved my progress. Yeah, no, no takesies, backsies. 32% uh, done. Good. Yeah, all right. And I've used about a third of me, uh, a third of me supply. All right, we need a slightly wider attack angle then, I reckon. Uh, just to just to make sure that we get through a lot of this before uh, before it's done. Now, I don't know if it's going to force me to complete 100% or whether it'll get to like 80-90% and go, yeah, good enough. I mean, that's the kind of employer I am. You go, yeah, that'll, that'll about do. I mean, no need to break your back over it. I mean, I'd be, I'd be pleased with that. That would be something that pleased me. Um, but, uh, but as it stands, no. All right, well, look, I, I mean, to spare you, uh, just, you know, general not a lot going on here, uh, we'll... We'll get to either uh, 300 litres left in the tank, I've got 600 at the moment, or when I inevitably make some kind of egregious vehicle driving error, and then we'll pick up the action from there. I've changed the camera angle on you. Yeah, I know, keeping you guessing, you see. I'm keeping the visual stimuli uh, suitably stimulating. Uh, as you can see, I have the head of an owl. I can, uh, I can rotate through a full 360 de degrees in either direction. It's a useful skill to have. Anyway, uh, I'm, I'm down to under 300 litres now, and uh, it's, all, it's all cracking on. I haven't checked the old progress meter to see if we're anywhere close to being done. Um, I'm hoping we will be, given that I've got 2% left in my uh, capacitron here. Um, I've, done, I've got a modest amount of confidence that we'll be absolutely fine. Uh, but 
so but we'll see soon enough off right flip it yeah don't worry about the train it only just went past i've turned me turn my headlights on all 29 of them uh that way you know we lit up like a battlestar galactica everybody should see us coming uh, there you go yep fire it up oh this feels good this feels like i'm gonna have enough left over to uh to you know do a second bit on some places because i'll be honest with you I have no idea which bits I've missed, and it's inevitable I will have missed some bits. But that's all part of the rich tapestry that is the farming simulator. You might be looking at this and going, ah, oh, flaming egg, and, and having never played it, right? If you have played it, that's an entirely different matter, because you know what to expect. If you haven't played it, you kind of go, I don't get it. I don't, why would you do this to yourself? Why are you, why are you doing it? I'll tell you why, because it's flipping satisfying. That's why, and, and on uh, on a second screen, if you have one, or on your headphones, if you own those, you could be listening to an audiobook, or you have a movie on, or, or any number of things, while well, you're doing what, on the surface, looks absolutely tedious. Uh, but it's not. No, I'm, I'm not even kidding. Uh, it's, it's, it's far from being tedious, it's actually jolly satisfying, particularly when you migrate to the point that it's your own field, and your own tractor. And you hate that tractor, because you only bought it because it was cheap. But it's rubbish. And you kind of go, oh, I should have splashed out on that other tractor. Right, I've got to bring in this crop of oilseed rape in order to make enough money to go and uh, to go and get the tractor I should have bought in the first place. And we are out of juice. Right, park it. Okay. It's not like I can even leave a marker to go. Oh, that's, that's where I was up to. Is she happy enough? Yep. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's going to make me 3,800 quid. All right, okay, that's not terrible. Uh, right, we've got uh, a choice of a bit of spraying. Yeah, 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 yeah. Spray, fill 13, get the weeds killed. Okay, all right. Or spray field 16, Max Wachter there, he's, uh, he's into it. Well, we've got Sandra Steiner. She seems quite stripy. And, uh, and then we've got Sandro Ab. Abergelin, 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 who wants me to go and plough it? Well, I'll tell you what, people, I'll tell you what I'm not going to do, any of those things. No, I'm going, I'm going shopping for my own personal land. Now, if we switch over to the farmlands uh, option here, you'll see, you've got all these fields mapped out, and I could, I could probably buy one of those, that's 172 grand, uh, this one up here, field number one. That's 193,000. I've got 1.5 million in the bank. I opted for medium difficulty because I've got to buy all of the necessary gubbins to, to make this work afterwards, you see. Uh, plot 23, that's 350 large of anyone's money, specifically mine. Uh, or over on plot 19 is 180,000. And uh, that all looks good. But then you go, hold on, hold on there, Colonel. Uh, or Barry, depending on which name you're going by today. You've got all of these squiggly line areas going on here. Are they something too? And I go, yes, my friend, yes, yes, they very much are. You can buy one of these currently entirely unused pieces of land. And uh, I'm, I, I'll be honest with you, I've done a bit of scoping of this already, and I like this one. Hmm, 380 large for a heck of a lot of land. And uh, it makes me go... Why hasn't someone bought that already? Would you like to see why no one's bought that already? So this was going to be a seamless cut to me now giving you a tour of that bit of land. I'm, I mean, spoilers, I'm going to buy that bit of land, right? But uh, so it's, it's all going to be very funny. Very, very funny. Um, but uh, no, I'd, I'd hoped to be able to, you know, go straight there. But then it dawned on me that I don't currently have a vehicle and therefore I'm on foot. Um, and, and I don't want to be on foot, so I'm actually going to go all the way back to the shop and I'm going to endeavour to buy some kind of vehicle uh, to, to give you a tour. Yeah. I wonder if this shop sells cars. Feels like it should. This, this shop doesn't sell anything. That is a shop of, of deception. It's a charlatan of shops. How dare they? Anyway, the, good, I mean, the, the, actual, the actual shop is just there. Right. Right there is where it is. That's where we need to get to. Anyway, pro tip. Um, yeah, I did, if you if you want to get back to the shop after completing a job, don't complete the job until you've driven back to the shop. Otherwise, you, like I, am running. 
Uh, fortunately, I have great stamina, and uh, and the jodhpurs that I'm wearing really really do help uh, prevent any thigh rub uh, that might be occurring while I'm galloping here through a field of what I assume is cotton. It is cotton. It said so in the bottom end of the screen. And now potatoes uh, for a bit of variety. One one cannot live on cotton alone. Occasionally, a potato-based diet can be instructional. Uh, and soybeans, for those of you who like... There uh, uh, you go. No, this is intentional. This is a tour of crops of Oggenblatt, Ogen, uh, which I think is the name of the town. Over here, of course, you've got uh, canola, canola. Yeah. And in here, it's full of monsters or tornadoes. That's what the movies have taught me. Monsters or tornadoes, precious little else. Usually dogs, actually. Quite a lot of dogs in there, usually after your blood. Um, anyway, here we are. I think I filled that quite nicely. Uh, back to the shop. And we need, we need a, little, a little runabout. Um, it might not be the best use of my cash, but frankly, if I get something that I can just run about in, that'll be grand. So I'm looking at the cars section here, and you go, yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe a pickup truck would be good. And I kind of go, well, I have had adventures in a pickup truck in the past. Uh, they were they were great fun, and we we all had a jolly good time with that. But no, I think I'm I want something different. I want something that's out there and a little bit, you know, maybe it's got some greater utility for the future. Uh, a forklift, for example. <laughs> I'm actually feeling a forklift or a mower. Oh, see now you. That's 380 grand, yes. Or we could walk with one for 14k. And so at this point, that I am regretting having not started on maximum difficulty. Because then, having to have a poxy mower for a little while would be a thing that I would be considering. Because um, it's either, you know, own your own stuff and make your own way in the world... Or, uh, or it's working for other people. And frankly, I don't want to work for other people. No, they can, they can get ruddy knotted. No, I don't... I, mm, yeah, I see. How far do you think you're going to get before you go like, I'm going to... I don't know. Uh, miscellaneous. Hang on. Have you got a snowmobile? We've got a, a Light Wolf AgriPower. You know, that looks great. Yes. Okay, now. Friends... I'm going, to, I'm going to talk serious voice now, friends, right? Now, as much as we have a lot of fun playing Farm Simulator, and I, I am prone to making mistakes in Farm Simulator, um, I never engineer those mistakes. No, they just happen. What I'm about to do is buy something stupid. And you will say, oh, you've just bought something stupid. And I will say, no, I haven't. What I've bought is a freaking bulldozer. Come here. Look at it. I mean, okay, it's not as sporty as the one in my logo. I'm like, ooh. I don't know what it's for. Um, it's not going to be very quick. I would probably be able to run faster than it can travel across. But it's a bulldozer. And therefore, I am going to make use of this wherever possible. Go, would you at least consider leasing it? And I go, no, I will not consider leasing it. But what I want is an alternative paint job. Um, the, the Light Wolf AgriPower to Flaming Right. Yes, this will be my vehicle. I've got a million and a half that I don't necessarily deserve, and therefore the Light Wolf AgriPower is going to be my dog. Yes, come here. Ooh yeah, it's like I... I mean, if... If it wouldn't strip all of the uh, all of the potential ad revenue from this video, you have to imagine the theme tune from Shaft playing right now. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, purchase it. All right, so yes, this is deliberate stupidity, but what it isn't is uh, is putting myself in harm's way. I see that as being entirely uh, intentional and uh, sensible because it's a bulldozer. Look at it! Oh, yeah, I hope it's quick. How do I make that go up and down? All right, okay, we should work out the buttons. Show me the buttons. Uh, change cruise control? No, no, I'm not interested in that. I want to make the thing go up and down. How do you make the thing go up and down? Um, v. No. X. Ah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I want it. I want to lift it a little bit so that hurdles do not snag me endlessly. Might have a G. No, G's not so good. B. No. <sighs> mm, I wonder what it could be. Uh, well, I'll try X. 
yeah and then try B no try V no try Z try G try T no it's none of those buttons all right put it away again then put put it away put put it put it away there we go we'll worry about that when the time comes in the meantime okay <laughs> fantastic um oh yeah oh no show me the lights more lights yes you got one of them hazard numbers hang on there you go oh, that's a bit boring there you go yes stick them all on what about those how do i turn that i want to turn those on i want to turn i want to turn the emergency hazard i could look this up but i'm happy there you go oh, I'm flipping oh yes right and then yeah and all of this sweet as a nut i am barry turnips welcome to my thunderdome um great okay now then i'm gonna i'm gonna show you the bit of land that i'm gonna buy um you may you may realize relative so this is why i wanted to lift it up it's no good not being able to go over the smallest of curbs all right hang on, i'm gonna have to i'm gonna have to look up the button there you go it's j all right okay sweet let's rock excuse me dude come with me i will shovel you into the mincing machine um yes good oh it's not like i can't see me coming um yeah okay i think i've got a horn no it's this one yeah okay yeah that's i mean that's not quite as intimidating as i'd like anyway this is the uh not not, not this one uh up here this is the parcel of land in which i am interested look at this look at the menace oh, it's great I'll tell you something else with this number of lights gonna make working at night no flipping problem at all uh so here we are and we'll just we'll confirm this by uh, gazing no it's not this one it's the next one over i do beg your pardon um it's all right i'll be there in a moment i'm doing 23 miles per hour yeah no sorry beg you uh 10 23 kilometers per hour uh, that would be slower yes it would um but yeah no can i point at it no i can't point at it i'm doing stuff okay all right fine you see where that yellow van is? Yeah. Oh, do, there you go. It's going up round the outside of what will soon be my land. Now, if I could put a toll, bait, uh, toll booth there, that would be a nice bit of passive income. But somehow, I don't think that's going to be likely. And you know what? Uh, we need to, given that I've figured out how to raise this, extend talents. Yes. Oh, all will bow before me. Because uh, Zod's out at the moment. Right, here we go. This is, this is my bit of land. And, uh, you know, I'll be honest with you. I think it's abundantly clear why nobody has bought it. Uh, you've got this little bit that's workable down the bottom, but it's going to need a lot of tinkering to get that to do anything. Uh, and then, as you see over here, we've got, uh, we've got trees, which can be destroyed. Um, you've got rocks, which I think I'm probably going to need the terrain tool for. And, uh, and that will be an adventure in and of itself, not to mention that it will also be stupendously expensive. Um, yeah. Uh, so, yeah. With the, oh, hold on. I've got caterpillar tracks. Can we climb the rocks? Yes, bruv. No problem. Yeah. Got straight over it. Look at the articulation. Uh, hold on. Look at the way the dozer blade is now caught on this next rock. Yeah, but what if I, what if I retract talons? There you go. Now we're going places. See? Yeah, now we mean it. Do we? I think we do. Yeah. Try not to get it stuck straight away. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. Anyway, as we uh, as we progress up the hillside, yeah, uh, we're we're surely going to encounter uh, Julie Andrews or uh, or Heidi and Goat Peter, just kind of kicking it around, and Clara, of course, in her wheelchair, who they'll probably push down the hill at some point for laughs, and I'll catch her in my bulldozer scoop. That, of course, is relevant to very few people. Um, you will have to be in your mid to late 40s or beyond and uh, of a European descent in order to be familiar with the uh, adventures of Heidi, Goat Peter and Clara in her wheelchair. Um, yeah. I think it was Swiss, or it might have been German. It's, I, I'm relatively certain it's a, it's a, a Swiss uh, 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 myth, tale, not myth, just folk story almost. Except it's not, because they weren't that... Oh, either way, Goat Peter looked after goats. That's why they call him Goat Peter. And he was a rough young Herbert. Heidi was a well-to-do, if somewhat annoying young girl. And Clara was in a wheelchair. 
a sad hole it is. Like, oh, how much speed can we get up going downhill? Yeah, good. No, it's, it's clearly got some kind of robotic traction spoiler fun. So there you go. This is going to be the site of my farm. I'm going to turn it into a massive success. And it will be a massive success because I'll be the one massively successing it. Uh, if you would like to keep up with those encounters, they're going to happen on a vaguely frequent basis for a little while at least. And then it will be a slightly less frequent basis. But it will be a basis, frequent or otherwise. So uh, subscribe to make sure that that is a thing that you can do if you choose to do it. I'll catch up with you next time where some... Hold on. No, look. No, I'll show you. I'm committing. I'm committing to this now. Hold on. Wait. Hang on. Hang on. Wait. I need to get up to the top. Go over to this. Hit uh, X. Yep. Hit this. Yep. Go. Yes, play. 380 grand. Thank you very much. I'll take it. Oh, yeah. Go like fine if you want. Uh, no, that's good. That's most of my money gone. Good. Right. Next time. Adventure with a capital A and a big bulldozer. Cheerio! Now, as regular viewers of this channel will know, uh, adventure frequently comes from getting things wrong. Um, and, uh, and rarely do I deliberately get anything wrong. In fact, almost never do I get anything wrong. I'll occasionally do things in a stupid way. Uh, just, uh, and I'll know it's a stupid way to do it. But because I think it will work, and because I think that... There is great mirth to be had in it working, despite the fact it's a stupid way. Of course, when it doesn't work, then that in itself can, can generate some mirth. But I never, I never deliberately undertake something that I don't believe can be made to work. I am on the fence with regard to should I have played at a slightly higher difficulty level. Well, there's only one higher difficulty level, and it just means that you've got no money and... The main reason I didn't do it is because the prices you get for your crops is rubbish. I kind of go, some kind of custom sliders here would have worked quite nicely. You know, a much much lower bank balance to start off with, but uh, but relatively buoyant uh, crop prices would have been fine. Um, I've no need to experience everything quickly. Uh, I just want to be able to ex uh, experience everything without having to plough in the rest of my natural life to get to that point, he said, gesturing. So there you go. This is uh, this is going to be an ongoing adventure. The ballad here of Barry Turnips. I welcome you to the party, pal. <laughs>